It's been a long road for the directory assistance market since the industry began in the early 80s. Consumers previously had to pay as much as $2.50 to look up a telephone number. Now a number of different companies have emerged, all competing to give you free directory assistance. 1-800-FREE-411 was the first company to start up in the free directory assistance market. They pay for their listings by playing a short advertisement catered to your listing while you wait for your number to be looked up. This call is sponsored by... Overall's Dream Garage Giveaway. Press the star key now to receive a text message with details. The number you requested is... Lynn Chateau Oaks, Vice President of Marketing with 1-800-FREE-411, says they use the latest technologies and voice recognition to answer your call, and if the computer can't, it will transfer you to an operator who can. Speech technology has come a long way, but it still doesn't understand every single request. And so we answer about 50% of the calls through our automated solution and 50% of the calls with the live operator supported solution. So we think it's really important to have the live operator available to consumers who are looking for their information. 1-800-FREE-411 has answered more than 250 million calls since the company began in 2005, saving consumers more than half a billion dollars. One million Alabamians have also used the service, racking in savings of over one and a half million dollars. Three Birmingham area college graduates also decided to get into the free directory assistance industry with their business InfoPhone. InfoPhone allows callers to speak to a live operator between 7 a.m. and 10 p.m. seven days a week. It can provide phone numbers, movie listings, sports scores, and even give answers to trivia questions. InfoPhone owner Jason Smith says by having a live operator available to their callers, it makes the caller's overall experience better than having to go through voice recognition software. The benefit of calling us is you talk to a live person, you're talking to a human being, someone who can understand a lot better than a computer can, and you call us, and sometimes people don't exactly know what they're looking for, okay, and a computer can't think for them, but if you're talking to a person, they can help you figure it out what they wanted. Smith says their overall goal is to make sure their caller gets the information they are looking for. And we want our customers to not only have a free service, but also have a reliable service, an easy service, and one that's not going to take all day to get what they wanted. You know, our idea is get them the right number, or get them the right information as fast as possible, with as little hassle as possible. The company has taken more than 30,000 callers since the service began in April 2007, and owners say their company is continuously growing. While InfoPhone searches primarily for Birmingham area information, they have plans to expand to nearby cities including Huntsville, Montgomery, and Nashville. Smith says he believes the paid directory assistance market is slowly fading and will soon become a thing of the past. It's not just about phone numbers anymore, I don't think. I don't think you'll be paying for 411 in 10 years. No one will be. For more information on 1-800-FREE-411 or InfoPhone, and to you how much you get charged to dial directory assistance through your phone company, log on to our website at www.apr.org, click on the jukebox link, and look for the Alabama Business Report logo. On next month's edition of the Alabama Business Report, find out how you can be your own boss and also be successful at it. For Alabama Public Radio, I'm Adam Shivers.